Uh oh guys, you know what that means. Dollar store run. Um <clears throat> it was funny. I went to the dollar store first, the Dollarama, and then I went to the Dollar Tree and uh in the Dollar Tree there was um some chicks in there <clears throat> and I I couldn't help but ease eavesdrop because uh they were pretty loud. And I think they were trendies or something, or hipsters or whatever, because they're, they sounded like they're from another planet, <laughs> but <laughs> it was pretty insane anyway. So I'll show you what I picked up from the Dollar Tree first, uh, two items. So <clears throat> I found a letter opener and it's a full tang, um, there you can see the Full tang of the blade goes in. Um, I'm not sure how it's... I think it's probably just epoxied on, onto this plastic. But it looks fairly sharp. Um, we'll find out. <clears throat> I thought that would be a nice little handy dandy um, small edge there. Small blade. So that's what it looks like. And I'm sure it's pretty sharp. We'll find out. The the other item I got from the Dollar Tree. I seen a lot of people online buying these uh, wind windshield sunshades for their cars to um, help their, uh, I guess, their car to stay cooler and uh, for their seat from prevent their seats from cracking. So i wanted to give it a try for a buck really you can't complain too much so um and what i would use this for not for my vehicle per se but um basically as a sleeping pad to go underneath you to reflect some of the heat back at you um okay so it's got a couple little hangers there and this thing rolls out about it's probably not that big but like maybe I'm wrong oh wow it is pretty big okay so I'll move the camera back guys this thing is massive massive so that would definitely do a, a bo your body for sure um, depending on how tall you are your legs will be questionable they'll be hanging over but you can also tuck, um, if you find like a decent sized log out there, drag it in. That's if it's clean, drag it in your tent and put your feet up, keep your legs off the ground, or however you want to sleep. But that's huge, I didn't know it was that big, so that's all kind of an awesome buy for a buck. Let me flip it over here, guys, show you what's underneath. It's like a uh some kind of insulated foam that's coated on the one side so i guess you could probably buy another one of these in epoxy or that um spray on adhesive and then you have a double-sided uh double-sided deal there but this is super light compact um i just gotta get this thing folded back in on itself however that was Okay, and then it did come with um, some suction cups, which I have no use for now, because I'm not using it for the uh, the use there that they provided. But whatever, the original use anyway. So that's kind of a cool buy. I won't bother putting it back together right now. So those two items for, um, I have the letter opener with, it's, it's both, both sides of the blade are ready to roll. And then we have the, uh, reflective mat for under your body for sleeping. And then I'll show you what I got at the Dollarama here, guys. So this was, um, two bucks. It's a giant, um, glass container. And what I was looking for, um, actually I went in there, they had a bigger one. 
I was going to grab that, but I said, well, wait a minute. Um, what I'm using this for, guys, is I have these 80 hour candles for a buck 25. And they, yes, they, I'll do a test on that. For safety, though, I was thinking throwing this guy inside this glass container. And look, it's perfect tight, actually. And once this burns down, it'll get safer and safer. And what I was going to do was fill the inside in between the two glasses with water. And that way it's a safety device. So if it gets knocked over, whatever, water goes everywhere, it knocks your flame out. Also, these 80-hour candles, this is glass as well. These things get freaking hot. You can't even grab this with your bare hand unless you got a glove on when this thing's burning. So that's another purpose is the insulator from the water by using this container and then you know it's it's kind of an insurance policy a two dollar insurance policy F fill this up with water just below the uh edge of the you know the candle of course you don't want to snuff it out drown it so that's what i got i picked that glass jar up and then i'll do a test with the candle and in the water like this so they gave me a bunch of the nice thing is when you buy glass items from the dollar store guys they give you a bunch of this nice uh oh it's paper it's some it's like a thicker paper but really good stuff for tinder so hold on to that also found um pencil sharpeners i'm glad i grabbed these at the dollarama because the dollar dollar tree didn't have anything now i picked up a four pack they each have different size blades well double blade in each one but what you do is this is a survival gear believe it or not you throw your you take a, a stick or a twig and and you just basically shave it off and you collect all the shavings and that's going to help uh go into your tinder bundle and help get things going for you so this is an easy way to get some tinder without cutting your hand off so i'll crack that open a lot of people use these believe it or not for that and these have like a plastic um plastic uh container so it saves the shavings inside each one which is kind of cool so it's two different sizes you're probably going to be using the larger size opposed to the smaller of course but if this one ever goes on you you can always switch over to there and then it's a small phillips head screw so you can back those blades out if you need to for another purpose so four four pack for a buck can't beat that and then this is a three dollar item which I haven't seen there before. Everybody knows what these are. Magnesium fire starter. And I'm going to open this up. I'll pop it open with the, with the letter cutter. And I have a bunch of these uh, rods. You guys already saw. But this, this is... Uh, this is uh, the Dollarama brand, I guess. Oh, that's a decent uh, chain on there, too. So, basically, has a little bit of instruction. Um, use the back of your knife to scrape small pieces of magnesium into a pile the size of a dime. Get something like newspaper, dry grass, a.k.a. tinder, and put it next to the magnesium. Because magnesium only burns for a few seconds using the flint part of the magnesium fire starter which is this black piece and it has a striker and a tiny it's like a tiny saw blade on there see that on camera i don't know if i can even strike with this because it's so tight to the oh wow i get i'd have to take dechain that um anyway yeah so i'll give this a test out as well um you guys know i have the rods though and i got enough rods to last me but 
hey, I might as well grab this and give it a whirl too. So mostly survival gear today, guys, in the uh, my dollar store run. But I think I had some good finds there. So we got magnesium fire starter. We got some safety for the candle long term. We got some tinder uh, capabilities, getting tinder. We have comfortable uh, comfort option for sleeping. Uh, reflects up your body heat back up to you. And you'd want to sleep uh, with the silver side pointing up. You want to be on the silver side and have the white surface um, on the ground or on the tarp. It, normally you'd want a few layers, guys, because you don't want to be right on the ground. You want to have a tarp down um, and possibly um, get as high up off the ground as you can, especially in the winter time. And you want to be, you want to have barriers between you and the ground because the ground will just suck the life right out of you. And uh, then you're done. So, pretty cool items. Cutting tool. Um, yeah, so that's my little uh, shit hit the fan prepping uh, video, guys. And I'll do some testing with this gear. And it doesn't really cost much. What's a knife's a buck twenty five. These uh, pencil sharpeners probably two bucks, three bucks. The glass was two bucks. The comforter uh, item is the reflective comforter a uh, buck twenty five. So not a lot of money here, guys. And uh, all the more reason to get some 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 stuff in place for yourself. Skip that uh, meal out. Head to the Dollar Tree, get some gear, put it away, and then uh, then you have it. So that's it from now. For now, guys, from uh, Rob at the Off Grid Tiny House.